to go this way or that way? Or? Keeping up with an energetic toddler is tough work, but Misty and Donald Dennis are thrilled that 18-month-old Haley is running and walking. Their daughter was born with a rare form of scoliosis, which can lead to severe deformities. Uh, she has infantile scoliosis. Uh, she was diagnosed at four months, but was not casted until eight months. Haley was treated with traditional spine castings, but the dentists soon learned of another procedure called metacasting, which uses a specialized casting table. UAB orthopedic surgeon Dr. Joseph Corey is one of a handful of doctors in the U.S. trained in this metacasting technique, which involves twisting and turning the spine back to the correct position. Derotating or twisting the spine back, recognizing that scoliosis is, is a twisting and bending phenomenon rather than just a pure bending phenomenon and that's why it's successful. The cast is applying pressures on the spine and then as the child's growing in the cast they only have one choice which way to grow and that's out the top and down through the bottom and so it's sort of like tying a young tree to a post. The design of the casting table is crucial in that it provides doctors with a 360 degree access to the trunk. So the child lays on this this goes under their bottom, this goes on between their shoulder blades and their head goes in here. We can look underneath with this mirror and see where, uh, where we need to do the molding. So we can push on pulling the ribs this way, push on the ribs this way. Immediately after Haley's casting, x-rays showed dramatic improvements. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Corey will fit Haley with a new cast every two to three months. The hope is that her spine will continue to straighten and Haley can avoid surgery. So far we've been real happy with this cast and how she's seems to progress.